I like cucumbers, especially cucumber salad, a perfect accompaniment to a delicious dish of chicken paprikash. However, when people make the claim that cucumbers are some kind of superfood, that leaves a bad taste in my mouth. And indeed, those claims are being made about how cucumbers fight against cancer, about how they can lower blood pressure and fight diabetes, uh, about uh, lowering cholesterol. All of these claims, really not scientific. What are they talking about? They mostly refer to the fiber, the calcium, vitamin C in the cucumber. And indeed, it's true, those are there. But you know what cucumbers really are made of? Mostly water. 96% of the weight is water. Compare that to watermelon, which is only about 90%. So yes, such a cucumber will contain some calcium, about 12 milligrams. Compare that to the 500 to 1,000 milligrams which should be taken in a day. It will have about a gram of fiber. Compare that to the 25 or 30 grams that we should be ingesting on a daily basis. On the other hand, cucumbers indeed are sugar-free, they are fat-free, so they can be uh, consumed by diabetics. However, there's no such thing as a superfood. No single food should be revered as an angel or, in fact, castigated as being a messenger from the devil. There are good diets and there are poor diets. It's possible to never eat a cucumber and have a very healthy diet. It is also possible to have a diet that is absolutely filled with cucumbers and it can be quite unhealthy. Now remember also that a cucumber can be converted into a pickle. And when you do that, you're actually adding a lot of sodium. One pickle can have as much as 800 milligrams of sodium, and we should not be really taking in more than about 1,500 milligrams a day. So I would suggest instead go for a cucumber salad instead of having a dill pickle, because there you can control the amount of salt. So I hope that with this little discussion, I've been able to get you out of the pickle, and that is our Cup of Joe for today.